The Vice President Yemi Oshimbajo says there is a great need to create an environment for production and investment, adding that it is extremely important in the diversification of the nation's economy. Oshimbajo said this during his lecture at the 50th Convocation Ceremony Lecture of the University of Lagos. Susan Wardo covered the report. There was a massive turnout by academics, non-academic staff, students and pressmen at the 50th Convocation Lecture of the University of Lagos, where the Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Yemi Oshimbaju, was the guest lecturer of the event. The event themed Nigeria Rising, the Path of Prosperity, kicked off with the procession by the Vice President, major academic staff and prominent alumni of the university. The Vice President commended the efforts of the present administration while pinpointing the problems of Nigeria's economy. He blames the high level of corruption in the country for the failure of the economy. The other problem is a problem of extreme poverty. And I think it's important to continue to underscore the fact that our major problem has always been grand corruption, the direct stealing of government resources. I keep emphasizing, every time I emphasize it, there is a headline in the newspaper, Yemi Oshibaju blames previous governments. It's always a headline. But I do not mind repeating it ad nauseum, because it's the truth. And we must not allow it to happen again. He said the issue of the growing rate of poverty needs to be addressed. He added that there is need to work towards helping people use the nation's resources to aid the fight against poverty and provide more jobs opportunity in order to decrease the number of people in the job market and keep the economic growing. This implies that we must have a robust enough healthcare system that ensures that the average person is in good health. An educational system that guarantees education capable of preparing children for the opportunities and challenges of a knowledge economy. A thriving private sector which leads the economic activities of the country, supported by a business-friendly environment. A system of wealth creation, especially wealth creation options and safety nets, capable of taking millions out of poverty and providing for those who cannot work. For other speakers, they commended and spoke on the accomplishment of the institution while adding their voices to the need for the nation to address the increasing rate in unemployment. Staff, academic staff also in the area of research, they have been exhibiting their talent in different um, ways. Recently we just won the $4.5 million, $4.5 for now, until we get the counterpart funding from Nigeria. So we have $4.5 million research grants for um, African Center of Excellence for the University of Lagos. When the condition described above is reversed and there is high and rising unemployment rate with low job growth, a country automatically slides into poverty. The unemployment rate in Nigeria has been growing negatively to the extent that by the third quarter of 2018, 20.9 million Nigerians were estimated to be unemployed and 18.2 underemployed. The Vice President further said the federal government is working towards achieving a business-friendly environment to enable the ease of doing business and tackle all the challenges of the country's business environment.